Is it possible to predict price movements in the property market? Well, the answer is yes. There are specific fundamentals that cause property markets to change in value. Now, a market will either be growing, staying flat, or it'll be moving backwards. And it's these fundamentals that are at play causing those movements to occur. Now, property economists from right around the country agree with what those exact fundamentals are. And at Meridian, what we've done is establish a specific and specialized research model that is built upon analyzing those fundamentals. We employ some of the brightest minds in property analysis to assess these influencing factors and determine the likely direction of property values in any market around the country. Let's take a look at that model now and exactly how it works. At the top of our model sits the Meridian Investor Panel, comprising some of the brightest minds in economic studies. Each member is a leading analyst in their field and have been handpicked by Meridian to provide analysis, data and forecasts for fundamentals influencing property value. The purpose of the investor panel is to assess the fundamentals at state level, then city level and finally suburb level to determine the likely direction of property values right around the country. First fundamental is economy. More often than not, the strength of the economy will determine if the population is growing or declining. A weak economy leads to declining population growth, and a strong economy leads to increasing population. This leads us to our second fundamental, which is population growth. It is important for a market to have strong population growth, as these people moving into the area will have a requirement to live somewhere and will increase demand on the property market. The third fundamental is infrastructure. Infrastructure makes a location livable and ensures people moving to the area are retained and will live there long term, and not short term for employment purposes. Infrastructure is extremely important in retaining long-term residents and long-term demand. These first three fundamentals together create demand from owner-occupiers. Owner-occupiers own 70% of the Australian property market and therefore account for 70% of demand. For predictable capital gain, investors should be targeting markets that are attractive to owner-occupiers. The fourth fundamental refers to rental yields. Now, Investors own 30% of the Australian property market and are attracted to high rental yields. To maximise capital gain, investors should target markets that have the first three fundamentals in place, but also has the highest rental yields. This will ensure the market is in high demand from both owner-occupiers and investors. Then we have availability of credit. Most investors and owner-occupiers require bank funds to purchase property. An easy lending environment will encourage more demand from both owner-occupiers and investors. And therefore, when forecasting capital gain in the property market, investors should pay close attention to the lending environment and the availability of credit. At this point, you may have noticed that the first five fundamentals are all factors influencing demand. At this point, we must compare the level of supply and future supply to the forecast level of demand. Fortunately, we can forecast future supply by monitoring development applications in any suburb around the country. This will determine if a market will be oversupplied or undersupplied in the next one to four years. Finally, we have affordability. Affordability can be measured to determine if property buyers can afford to push prices up. We can determine if a market is affordable by assessing the percentage of household incomes being spent on mortgage repayments. By accurately assessing these fundamentals at state, city and suburb level, an investor has the ability to predict property price movements and purchase property in a market right before prices boom in value. The final step is to identify the right property at the right price. We'll share exactly how to negotiate the best price in one of our upcoming videos.